my name is Ali Pekka Kalasvu, and I am the Chief Executive Officer of Nakia. Following June's disputed presidential election in the Islamic Republic of Iran, many of you have been concerned about the state of human rights in that country. As people explore the way communications technology can be used to find new and innovative pathways to information freedom across the world, the question of internet freedom in Iran has been a topic of much discussion. As the CEO of a world leader in communication technology, I would like to set the record straight on the involvement of Nokia in Iran. The Nokia Siemens Partnership has contracts with countries across the globe to provide communications technology solutions. These include systems for both internet and cellular communication. The false information that has been circulating concerns the ability of our technology to be used for deep packet inspection and overall internet censorship. There have been false accusations of collaboration with the Iranian regime in conducting unlawful surveillance of the citizens of that country. It is important for you, our customers, to know the truth. Nokia Simmons Networks provided equipment to Iran last year under the internationally recognized concept of lawful intercept. Lawful intercept relates to intercepting data for the purposes of combating terrorism, child pornography, drug trafficking, and other criminal activities carried out online. A capability that most, if not all, telecommunications companies have. Mobile networks are not allowed to be built in Iran without this feature. It is part of telecom's network architecture. In fact, international telecommunications companies, including our own company in Finland and our operations in the United States and the European Union, are required by law to provide this capability. We believe providing people wherever they are with the ability to communicate is preferable to leaving them without the choice to be heard at all. Nokia is committed to serving the world of communication technology and fostering the effective flow of digital communication worldwide. Going forward, we will continue what we do best, connecting people.